Hello boys and girls, this is Mr. G coming to you again with another video on sorting and patterns. Now in earlier videos we started to look at how we can sort different objects based on their attributes. What sort of things did they have that were similar about them, the same about them, that would help us put them into groups because they were the same in a certain way. So now that we've found out how to sort out objects that have same attributes, the question for this video is, can objects have two attributes that are the same? Not just one thing, but can they have two things that are the same about them? Let's take a look. First example here, what do we see in front of us? That's right, we have a red square. And the next shape? it's also a red square. A little bigger, but it's also a red square. What do we see? What is our last shape? That's right, it's a red square. The biggest of the three, but it is a red square. Now, let's have a look at the attributes. What things are the same? And what things are different about these three shapes? Let's have a look here. Is the color the same? Yes, it is. They are all red. Next, is the shape the same? Yes, they are. They are all squares. And finally, the size. Are the sizes the same? No, they are not. They are not the same, but the color and the shape are. So we can say that this example here, there are two attributes that are the same. The color is the same and the shape is the same. So we can put these three in a group at times because they have two attributes that are the same. Now you give it a try. What shapes do you see here? That's right, they are circles. So what can we do? Let's see if there's anything else is the same. How about the color? Is the color the same in this example? The color is not the same. And we said the shape? The shape is the same. They are all circles. So yes to that. And finally the size. Are the sizes the same? You're right they are the same. So here we are, we have three circles, they're different colors, the shape, yes, is the same, and the size, if you look carefully, all the sizes are the same. So this example too has two attributes that are the same. So these three circles, even though they're different colors, they can go in the same category, and they have two attributes that are the same, not just one like previous examples. Let's have a look at another slide. Now when we sort, we can sort objects in more than one way using two attributes. Let's have a look at the triangles here in front of us. We have blue triangles and we have red triangles. What different ways can we sort these triangles out? Now that we've seen a couple videos on how to sort and what to look for, how can we sort them out? Let me get you started. I'm going to move this blue triangle right over here. What else can we do? What would you do next? Good. Move another blue triangle right in the same group. What else can we do? That's right, it's a little smaller but it's still a blue triangle. Let's put that one in the same group and finally another blue triangle. So that leaves us with the red ones and we're gonna move them right here just to put them in their own little group. Now let's have a look here. Do we see, does this work on the left, we have triangles. They're different sizes, but they're all triangles and they're all blue. On the right, we have more triangles, but 
they are also different sizes and they're red. So the two attributes that we use here to divide or separate and make groups on the left we group them because they're the same color and the same shape and on the right we sorted them out because they are the same shape and the same color even if they're different sizes they can still go in the same group because they have the same two attributes now we can also sort them out in a different way we can sort them out because they're the same shape and the same size have a close look do you see any triangles that are the same size we know now that they're triangles so they have that in common but are there any triangles that are the same size you're right there are this small triangle can go with the red small triangle this bigger blue triangle can go with this red triangle they're the same size this blue one if I move it all the way over here can go with this red triangle and I'll take this red one and put it here now boys and girls what do you see here in front of you we have sorted out triangles once again in a different way they're not all the same color but if you look closely they are triangles so that's one thing that makes them the same and another thing that makes them the same is the size there are two triangles on your left here that are same size just different colors so we can sort them out and put them into groups like that so that's what this video has been about being able to find more than one thing that is the same so you can put them into categories into different groups because they are similar in two ways. Boys and girls, this is Mr. G signing off one more time. You've done a fantastic job. Join me again for another video on sorting and patterns. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.